my channel today it's a very you know easy quick day for me um i want to make something fast for dinner i don't want to wait too long and yeah i just want to do this as fast as i can so this recipe was taught by my mother of course like always and i think it's like from generation to generation has has it passed to all the daughters and then the granddaughters and etc um this recipe it's like literally it takes not even five minutes to make plus the rice the rice takes like about 15 minutes to make anyway so this is tuna salad it's not the regular tuna salad that everybody eats but um i hope you enjoy it ignore what i'm wearing i have my whatever pajama shirt on it's it's a uh, I just was not feeling getting all dolled up for the video or whatever so yeah anyway what do you need you need some tomatoes uh, you need tuna any type of tuna this is gonna sound super bougie but I don't eat tuna from the States not because um, it's bad it's just that me personally I don't like it so I get tuna from back home from Ecuador every single time somebody travels from Ecuador to the States I asked them to bring me some tuna and I have tons tons of tuna in my in my pantry um, this is called ventresca from the tuna I think this is the belly part of the tuna I think I don't know I don't know but anyway it's on olive oil it comes from Ecuador it's delicious it comes in chunks instead of like that flaky kind of thing that we have here in the States so yeah Anyway, so you the, the the thing that you do with this is you eat it with white white rice. I already have the rice making, you know. Um, I eyeball the rice like how much I want to make. I don't measure it. I just make enough for Tommy and I, and I don't like make too much because I don't like to waste food. Um, yeah. After that, I, for the salad, you need obviously the tuna. You need some tomatoes, some kettle corn. You need some onion, lime, salt, pepper, and that's it. So like I mentioned, there's no rocket sign about this dish. Um, I just literally just grabbed some onions and I chopped some and put them in the in this like bowl. Um, I don't use that much onion, it's just for the taste. Um, of course, then you will open up your tuna. This is how this tuna comes. It comes in olive oil, so you already has like a delicious olive. Hey, why I can't open this shit? There you go. You see, it comes in chunks like that. Oh, I just removed the oil from the can. Just place it on the bowl like that. I use two cans because we're two people, you know. There you go, remove the excess of oil. And I love it because it comes in chunks, look at that, chunks of tuna. Recycle this. Anyway, so after you have your tuna like that, you will go ahead and open up your can of of corn. This one I think is vacuum sealed already. So I don't have to, it doesn't have water in it. There you go. Pour it in your salad. Look at that. Yummy. Um, lastly, I'm gonna put some tomatoes. You can put any tomatoes. It just happens to be that I had cherry tomatoes in my pan, in my fridge. So I'm just gonna use them. And I already washed them before I put them in my fridge before people start judging. You know, I put like, like if I, if I have a whole tomato, I will put the whole tomato in. In this case, I'm just putting some. I think this is, I think this is good enough. Did 
So you put that, you will grab a lime, and you will pour the whole lime. You will pour the whole lime in the salad. It gives it this citric kind of like taste. just mix it together you know to make sure that all the ingredients are very and you add some salt I use pink Himalayan salt Tommy just got home perfect timing mix it some people put potatoes like baked potato in it um just it just takes longer so I don't like a little bit of ground black pepper gives it a little bit of a kick and that's it guys this is all this is like the tuna salad that we eat I'll go ahead and place it with a little bit of white rice and it's ready to eat. This is a quick 15 minute recipe for you if you don't wanna if you don't wanna be like cooking for a long time. It it has a lot of nutrients in it and it tastes amazing. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you on my next video. Bye.